Hey YouTube, I wanted to show this um, home gym piece of equipment here. Um, some of my previous videos you might see a previous home gym, but this is some a new place starting over doing some new things home gym wise and whatnot. So I wanted to show you, I didn't have this piece of equipment before, but I wanted to show it to you now. I got this on Amazon. It's a multi-station, multi-purpose, multi-functional pull-up bar, pull-up system. I'm going to walk you around through it right here. I searched for this. I've, I've gone without a machine like this for a while, and I was looking around for another one to replace it, but I wanted it to do a few different things, and I wanted to show you the one that I ended up with here. So Amazon, not, a, not, a, not an inexpensive piece of equipment, but not an overly uh, pricey one either. So probably in the, I think it was in the $250 range, if I'm not mistaken. So check that out. But let me walk you through it. So as you can see at the bottom here, it's got a nice foundation, solid bars that go out about four feet from the wall. You got a bar on the back, has a nice, nice bracket on the other side of it, bolts on with two bolts, bar across, bar down and around to the, to the end. Then you got the, you know, just nice walk, walkway right there. Got a medicine ball there. Then you got a brace right there in the middle, right there down below, across, hanging it pretty, adding to the sturdiness. One thing about these machines, you wanna have it pretty sturdy. Your, your body weight's gonna be up there. These things can hold about 300, 300 to 400 pounds of body weight and weights, um, including the what the system weighs. So it's a pretty good amount. But let me keep showing this, showing this, showing this uh, up, the, up the rails here. So the rails come on. And you got a couple of rails in the back that also help with the, with the bracing to hold your body weight. You got these go up to the top here. They go to the top, and you end up with a you end up with the the pull up bars here. They give you some diverse areas to grip. You can grip this way, grip like this. Do some bar hangs, pull up hangs, or pull ups all the way if you're that strong. I'm gonna, I like to hang, I like to do the, some hanging, and I like to um, use assisted pull-ups with some bands to help me get, the, get my body weight up there. It's a great back workout, shoulder workout, arm workout. So here you got the wide grips, you got close grips. You can grip it here if you want. Grip it here, grip, have it, different options. But um, you can also put some more tape. These handles that are on there are kind of loose. I plan to tape it up, put some added grip to grip up there. It's a lot of welds, a lot of reinforced corners to hold your body weight up there. Another, Again, another bracket, solid this way, solid across, and it's gonna hold your weight up. I'm about 220 pounds, I fluctuate from 215 to 225, and it holds me very easily. So, another feature here is you got this backrest. The backrest is gonna hold you when you do uh, pull-ups, um, sit-ups. So another good thing about that is it's adjustable. So you can adjust it forward and backward there. So I'll get another reinforcement right here. Reinforced areas, everything's reinforced. Another key to this system here is going to be the, the pull-ups themselves. So well, not the pull-ups, the, the setup. So you can adjust these to your height. So check this out. You can lift this up. And go down. So if you're a little shorter, you can adjust that to your body height. If you're taller, you can go up with it. Or you can just you can just take them off altogether. Take it off. And that's going to come in handy when you want to use the next the next accessory, which are these bar these bar holders. So Right there, you can slap that on, and then you have a bar going across for bench pressing, squatting, um, bar hangs from the ground. Just put your 45 pound bar there, your 35 pound bar across there, and now you can do a variety of other movements. So you can pull up a, I usually don't, don't use it for that purpose, but you can pull up a flat bench right there and set up a, a, your bench pressing right there. The thing about it, it's gonna be a little bit narrow from, from side to side, 
So you're, you're just gonna have to work with the grip a little bit, but if you want, if you need a system that does a lot more things than just a couple, this, this could be a system that, that does quite a bit of gym, gym work for you, if you especially if space is, is a factor. So first of all, you got a quality frame. It's sturdy. You can do your bar, your pull-up hangs. You can do your pull-ups. You can do your sit-ups. You can do flat bench uh, with the with the, um, the bar going across. You can do squats. You can do a variety of things. It doesn't have the it doesn't have like a thing you can do push-ups on it. You know, some of these systems have a little some little handles on the end for, to do push-ups. But you could drop these all the way down and use these for uh, push-ups as well, if you want to. So that's another thing you could do. What else, what else? I'm leaving one thing out. So you, you can do dips. So the last thing you can do is sit right here and do your dips. So a dip pull-up station is what this essentially is. Dips, you can go forward this way, backward that way, and utilize this kind of system. Stepping all over my other equipment. So I used, I chose black and yellow, but I think they have some red, red and black and a blue and black. So a couple of options for you color-wise. These just happen to be colors that um, I don't mind at all. So multi-system, multi-dimensional pull-up dip bar, dip station, sturdy. I'm not sure if it's American made or overseas, but I'll get you that information on the write-up and try to write some details about it. So anyways, I've had this for about, for about a month. Pretty easy to put together um, if you're mechanically inclined, nuts and bolts. I did it all by myself. They recommend two people for it, but I did it by myself. So that's not too bad, not too hard to put, put together. Make sure everything's tight and snug. Um, don't over tighten. All the bolts were there. Everything was pretty pretty easy to, to see what they were doing between a picture and the verbal instructions and just kind of having a know-how. So again, a um, nice piece of equipment to add to my new um, garage gym. So if y'all have any questions, any comments, please uh, make that down below and we'll, we'll chat about this. All right, y'all take care. Good luck.